for those of you who use Ham Radio Deluxe and Logbook of the World, and this uh, little bit of software is going to be right up your street. Um, basically, what it does is it cuts out the middleman. In other words, um, it, um, it, it stops you having to export your log from Ham Radio Deluxe and then convert it into the Logbook of the World format and then upload it onto Logbook of the World. You know, it can take quite a, quite a while. Um, basically, it, just, it, it means that you can, um, with a click of a button, upload your log straight onto Logbook of the World without any messing around. So all you do is you go to the website, which I'll link, I'll put a link at the end of this um, um, video. You go there and you download the piece of software and you install it onto your computer. And then you fill in the information, which you've already done on Ham, Ham um, Logbook of the World. That's the TQSL private keyword, key password, your username and password. So that's in Logbook of the World. And then you have to go to setup, and you have to put in the path to where your um, where the where the files are stored for um, converting the log. Because this, this is this is how it converts the log, but it does it very very quickly without even you realising it. Um, so you go here. So when you've worked a few stations and you're ready to upload them onto Logbook of the World, you basically just click this button once. I mean this. I haven't got any to upload, so it's telling me to go and work some new ones. But um, if you have got some to upload, it would do it pretty quickly, and it would tell you how many it's uploaded. And alternatively, you can click on Import um, Logbook of the World Confirmation. And again, there aren't any um, to be downloaded at the moment. And, and it would import the confirmations into Ham Radio Deluxe. So that um, when you're in your logbook, you can see that um, who you sent, you can see who you've sent to, and also who who you have received back. This is a really excellent piece of software. Um, you can also um, set it up if you've got an EQSL account by just putting in your username and password, and um, and um, putting in a path to where the images are to be stored. You can also import. Um, uh, lots of um, you know all your EQSLs onto your computer, um, and they're actually you know you can see the images, so you can open open one up and look at it and print it if you want. Saves a lot of hassle. This is a really excellent piece of software that um, you know if, if you are using Ham Radio Deluxe and LOTW, then uh, you know I, I would um, definitely urge you to go and uh, take a closer look at it because it uh, it will save you a lot of work in the long run. Believe you me.